MUCA was established in 1972 and over the years has really gathered a very strong reputation for quality. We're the first company in Nigeria to give a three-year warranty for our mattresses and in consumer tests, MUCA's quality is rated above that of the competition. MUCA is basically a polyurethane manufacturing company. The two main components of our products are mixed together and what is called an exothermic reaction occurs which makes up flexible foam. The second part of the process is what we call conversion, where the foam is basically cut into various sizes and covered with textile, and then you have a mattress. Nigeria, over the last eight years, has gone through quite a bit of change. There's a strong emerging middle class, more people moving out of home earlier. Industry is bustling, so that means more hotels being set up. There's more demand for the product now than there was 10 years ago. Hello, good afternoon, Mocha Foam. Who am I speaking with, please? We sell our products through 400 registered distributors who under them have about 5,000 sub-distributors. If you buy Mocha, you are rest assured you are buying value for your money. Because of the good quality of Mocha products, when people buy one, they come back to buy two. We have about 21% of the market share in Nigeria and we see MUCA hitting 15 billion Naira in the year 2013. We will do that by introducing more efficiency in production to see how we can deliver the same quality at lower costs. And we are starting a new plant in the north to be able to reach the northern part of Nigeria. We believe the growth will come from there. We are a company that is import dependent and right now we have a situation where the exchange rate has gone up. So that's a big challenge, so that we don't price our products out of the reach of the people. Muka was acquired by Actis in 2007, and very uniquely in Nigeria. We have a combination of both an acquisition and a management buy-in, and the family still owns part of the company. And on the back of this investment, many more family businesses in Nigeria have made inquiries and are looking at taking in professional investors. Actors' role and involvement has been positive at every level. We've been able to constitute a formal and proper board and are being held to very high standards of corporate governance. And Actis has enabled us to attract the right level of human resources, networking, and international best practice. And we've been much more stringent about international environmental standards. This is work in progress, but a lot of the push has come through Actis. We experience challenges along with many, many other manufacturing companies in Nigeria. One which is the issue of power and energy. Another challenge is the issue of transportation. Foam is a volumetric product, and so it costs a lot of money to transport it along great distances, which is one of the reasons why we're opening up a plant in the north. Our vision is to be the clear leader in Nigeria within three years, and to be the clear leader in Africa within five years. And we are concentrating right now much more on R&D, in terms of moving into other spheres of foam, for example, rigid foam, but also looking at how we can continue to improve on our product quality. When you sleep on a mocha foam mattress, the next morning you wake up feeling very fine. So I think we're pretty much very near our goal already. <laughs>